Join us today as we test whether the glass actually makes any difference to your gin and tonic experience. Or can you just have it in a mug? Hi everyone, I'm David. And I'm Mark. And we are the Doddolds. It's gin time. Woo. Woo. <laughs> Lots of gin. Um, yeah, because, well, as we just said, um, we're testing whether the glass actually makes a difference or whether it's just snobbery. Yeah, because there's lots of different types of glasses out there, aren't there? And when, yeah. Sometimes when you go to a, a bar or a pub, sometimes if you ask for a G&T, they'll serve it in a long glass. Sometimes they'll serve it in a Copa glass. Sometimes they'll serve it in one of these little small ones. And hopefully they don't do it in a mug. Well, some of the, I don't know, some of these hipster bars <laughs> nowadays. <laughs> well, no, if you're anything like us at home, we all just sometimes reach for a glass and it varies Probably not to this end, but it varies between these three, probably. Yes. So we've got the same gin in every vessel. And the same amount of and same everything. Amount. Yeah. Um, um, would you like to pronounce this one, my love? Um, Caravan, I think. It's a Scottish, um, it's a modern London dry. So again, we wanted to have kind of like just a standard gin, not flavoured or anything like that. Just to... Oh, you... lovely noise. Um, just to see if we can sense the botanicals. So and we've just put a, a segment of lemon in. Yes. So we've got 50 mils of gin, as per usual, little can of tonic. And I would say if you have the option of tonics, bottle or cans, we always prefer to go can because environment. Yeah. And it's handy. And it's handy having it like that as well. So shall we start with this end? Uh, I yeah, guess can how do. people say you're supposed to have your gin mm. and tonic. We will find out. We will. Mmm. That's really smooth, crisp, and fresh. I'd say that's how I describe that gin. Yeah. I'll tell you what, I, you can smell the lemon. I know it's only like a little slice, but you can smell that straight off. Because I think the idea of a Coke glass is with it being kind of funneled to the top, or tapered, shall we say, um, it's supposed to funnel the smell into your nose. Mm. So that's why some people prefer them. But let's see. Oh yeah, that is really smooth. Like I say, I can smell the lemon, mm. but you don't taste it too much. It's been macerating in there for a while, but... Macerating? Oh no, you get the hint at the end of like the lemon. Okay, yeah. let's try it in a full uh, glass, would you say? Mm -hmm. You see, so straight it, now, I, I, when I was drinking that, I didn't smell the lemon and I didn't taste lemon. Oh wow, that does taste different. Yeah. That is so strange. That's really strange because you, you just said that one didn't really smell, uh, didn't really taste the lemon. I thought it did. Well, I got I got like the lemon flavour afterwards. I didn't get the, the right. lemon flavour initially. No lemon but, flavor. yeah. And also, to be fair on that one, I wasn't breathing in as I drank it, which I probably should have. That's crazy. That and also, for science reasons, it is all the same lemon. <laughs> yeah, <I> mean, <laughs> all <laughs> chopped from the same lemon. Yes, right, okay. No, I can't imagine this being any different. Really. That's just got a wider bottom. No, it's Do you lemon not like again. A, a wide bottom. You're not listening to my jokes. A wide bottom. <laughs> I'm supposed to ignore your jokes. Oh yeah, I can smell the lemon again. And you can taste the lemon. Not as strong as that one. No. But I could taste it more than that one. Yeah, so far that does taste nicer, which is odd. Yeah. Unless it's all psychological. And because we well, think that's I've supposed to taste theory. nicer, our brain is telling you nicer. I do have a theory, but let's yes. just, I'm going to test my theory by using the mug. <laughs> I've not drank alcohol out of a mug since uni. Now I don't know how that fits into my theory. Can't smell lemon at all. See, that doesn't taste of anything to no. me. Isn't it weird? That literally is tasteless. Yeah. <sighs> I, see, I've got to, I, I will be honest and candid with everyone. I thought we'd start this and I would struggle to find differences Me between too, them and honest. thought it's not going to make that much of a difference. Yeah, but it really does. So my theory is that it's it's the size of the opening that matters. <laughs> so because this one, this one you, you literally get your nose into the glass. Yeah. And you're not used to a large opening. <laughs> <laughs> so we, Drink the pain away. Yeah. So my nose goes into that one, right? Nose doesn't go into this one, but I can. You don't want to get your nose in the hole, do you? I don't. <sighs> oh, wonderful. You started talking about the size of the opening. <laughs> you knew what would happen. From a science perspective. Oh, okay. It's perspective. It's perspective. <laughs> Continue. 
So why don't, if you have these sorts of glasses at home, do it yourself and then leave us a comment below because it's, then it's an excuse to drink a G&T, let's be honest. Who, I mean, who needs an excuse? But we're giving you one. <laughs> drink responsibly, though. Drink you responsibly. Do no, but like, try it in a different glass. See if you think it makes a difference and let us know below what you yeah. thought. Yeah, genuinely, I cannot tell you the, the, the difference between that and that. Crazy. But even that and that, I would say. Mm. And also, I think it's good having a stem on your glass just so, so you, you don't, don't melt, you don't, you don't heat the glass up with your hands. It's always a good, good, good advice. It is. Well, that was an educational video. If you have liked it, please do like the video. It really does help us. Yeah, give us that thumbs up. Yes, and uh, give us a subscribe, please, as well. Yeah. And hit the notification bell so you get notified of future videos. Yes. And if you want to know three simple ways to spice up your G&T, click this video next.